This is Ross for Castronado interviewing Garrison True at the at the January 2022 Burbank Hollywood Show. So now, out of all the characters in film and television that you played, which one is your favorite? I'm sorry, I didn't hear that. Which, out of all the characters in film and television that you played, which one is your favorite? Oh boy, I had a lot of them. There was a, a movie I did um, where I played an Irishman named Dobson, and that was um, Black Beauty. And I also created the role of Henry Brewster on Petticoat Junction, which was a whole different thing. So that that gave me an, an, a chance to, you know, play different things, and they liked me so much. The same company did Beverly Hillbillies, Billies, so they put me on that show for a while. So you know, it was a diversified career. But I always said, best said, you know, I was an also ran actor in my eyes. I never got to be a star, but I loved the craft. I love the I love the working of an actor, and therefore I segued into coaching and eventually casting uh, behind the scenes because I love the business. All right, nice. And even though I'm retired, I still think of it a lot. You know, this this reason for me being here was when they invited me. I originally said no. And then they talked to me and said, there's a big Star Trek group out there, we'd love to see you. So I said, okay. So we did it. But I realized that the show was the first to air called The Man Trap. 1966, the first episode to air. And I'm probably one of the few left of the cast. And uh, little did I ever think that all those years ago, when we thought we were doing not so great television, especially with the boots they put us in, they put us in Italian boots that killed your feet. Yeah. You were in them one hour and you had to wear them 16, but we were really happy to get them off at the end of the day. But the, that whole looking back, one never knows. Yeah. You know, something that you say, this is never going to fly, has come around in my life 56 years later to say, hey, come be part of this. You know, it's an interesting turnaround. And look at Shatner. Shatner's made a, so much of, of the start of that. Oh, yeah. To what he's done since. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, nice. And he's still healthy and he's still getting to do his stuff. That's right, yeah, definitely. Right. Very nice. Which role was the hardest one to prepare for? Uh, I had good training, and that's basically for any young actor starting off, is to get the good training. Don't rush to get, you know, started. Work at your craft. So the answer to that is no part. And I've done a lot of parts on the stage that are here and gone that night that were very difficult. But I, but they, with the right training, were not difficult at all. So I don't know any answer to that. They all are a challenge. All right, very nice. And which do you prefer? Do you prefer film work or stage work or television work? Uh, I l love the stage. I think any actor who started in the stage, on the stage, would tell you that. But there is a technique difference, you know? And I love the, the adjusting to the technique when you're in front of a camera. There is a whole way of learning how to, how to work before the camera. The basic thing is that most theater actors, when they go on to television, they're too big because they're still doing what they do on the stage. And really, the, what you have to do is what you do in the theater, you have to hit the back wall. All of a sudden, when you're in front of a camera, it's the front row. Oh, I see. You cut it back. Right, yeah. You cut it down. And you 
you don't move as much, you know, the camera, you, you do this and you, you move left to right, you're out of focus. So you learn how to condense and focus on what you're doing more intensely All right. than, than the freedom of this thing. Very nice. Well, thank you for allowing me to interview you. You're very, very welcome. You have a good day. All right, thanks. You too. Thanks for uh, your thank interest. Thanks. Thank you. Happy New Year. Well, there you have it. That was Ross Castanato interviewing Garrison True at the January 2022 Burbank Hollywood Show.